Hi, this is Kevin Battersby at the Toski Battersby Golf Learning Center in Coconut Creek, Florida, PGA Class A professional. In this clip, I'm going to show you how a golf club is cast. In actuality, we don't want to cast the golf club, but commonly for most amateurs, where you lose your speed and power and centrifugal force is unlike the curve I have set up here of the balls, casting the golf club would be the golf club going out and around, actually more to the left. If we just want to use baseball, it'd be more like a right-handed golfer swinging to third base. Okay, to prevent that, and the reason we want to prevent that casting was when the club's up here, there's a shaft angle between my forearm and the club of a 90 degrees. When I come down, that angle is supposed to be maintained for my power, so it gives a spring load effect of the head at impact. Well, when I cast the golf club, you can see the angle is being reduced and diminished, and it's just a, it's like hitting it with a wet noodle as compared to hitting it with a, a firm strike. So the exercise that will help you get rid of casting and get your swing on the inside, create more centrifugal force and power in contact, is to aim the golf club parallel to my club here, perpendicular, and my feet to the side, almost at a 45 to the ball, and allow the club to swing around my body in this arc, but my body actually does not turn back to the left. In other words, as I swing back, the face is turning back left, but I hold my body in position so as not to really rotate back to the left. In so doing, when the club gets up here, it stays in here and does not cast and creates a nice angle from inside, you can see here, which actually straightens my arm. But what it does, it maximizes the speed of the club at impact to release there. So aim the club down the line, normal setup, turn your feet sideways, and then allow the golf club to swing on that arc. Okay, and it really res resembles a field goal, which is why I set up these balls here. So this is an excellent drill to really show you how not to cast a golf club, which costs you power. This exercise will help you learn to not cast the club from inside. Thank you. It's Kevin Battersby.